China made a major advance in aerospace propulsion by testing the world's first oblique detonation engine, powered by standard aviation kerosene. The experimental flight in 2025 used the nation-unique JF-12 shock tunnel, reaching 16 Mach speed, or about 20,000 kilometers per hour. Experts called it a leap that could reshape both military and civilian aviation. The new engine works through shock-induced detonation combustion, releasing energy at a rate up to 1,000 times faster than conventional engines. Its thermal efficiency exceeds 75%, compared with about 35% in traditional designs. The chamber structure is compact with an 85% reduction in length and 40% less weight, yet it achieves 10 times the thrust density of liquid hydrogen engines. Researchers solved ignition delay challenges of RP3 kerosene using triple innovation in compression, catalytic mixing, and chain reaction control. They also developed self-healing ceramic composites that tolerate 3,500 degree heat, extending material life fourfold. If applied in defense, the engine could raise missile range to 18,000 kilometers and cut interception windows to under 90 seconds. Civil aviation could shrink Shanghai to Los Angeles travel to half an hour, while space planes may lower launch costs to one-tenth current rates. China now leads the field as the United States and Russia pursue slower hydrogen-based programs. Experts say the breakthrough marks entry into a new detonation propulsion era, signaling a transformative phase for global aerospace and strategic technology.